Yeah, those council members say Katoria Martin cannot be an honest broker. Those uh, those city council members say Katoria Martin, the city attorney, can't be an honest broker. When it comes to Richard's disposal, they want her to recuse herself. Jackson's garbage service getting back on track after the city council approved an emergency contract for Richard's disposal after a year-long court fight. But the legal battle over garbage continues. Richards has filed a lawsuit asking a Hines County judge to reverse a recent city council no vote and give the company a six-year contract. One big question, who's going to represent the city in the new lawsuit? The council did have comments in the open meetings. Many believe city attorney Katoria Martin has a conflict of interest and should step aside. And we can't have a city attorney just colluding with someone that's trying to sue the city. Several council members we spoke with say Martin should recuse herself from the case. It's because for the past year and a half, she has been an advocate for Richards trying to get the contract passed for the mayor as the primary spokesperson for the mayor. The majority of the council are worried about her representation of the council and honestly have a lack of trust. And so we need to move past that. If not Martin, it's unclear who would defend the city's interests in court. Council members have been advised that state law plus an attorney general's opinion prohibits the council from hiring private outside attorneys. The city attorney should have advised us not to vote on that if that would have been an issue. And so that's a big concern. Council members who voted to pay those attorneys now worried they could be on the hook financially because of what some consider to be bad legal advice from Martin. And her interpretation of the law, as I have always seen it, was basically wrong. And if she would do her job, um, you know, and if she had been doing her job, we wouldn't be here in the first place. Now, we did reach out to the mayor's office, but they had no comment to what those council members were saying. They also said City Attorney Martin was not available for an interview. Tonight, we're live at City Hall, Ross Adams, 16, WAPT News.